Uh, and we're about to go in and record 21 tracks, 20, 19 tracks for the Raven Watkins album. <laughs> Pat, you're doing jumping jacks? Yeah, so I turned it off. Do you want me to turn it off on you? No, should I turn it off? Save some for the recording, whatever. <laughs> First time I saw Reagan and Watkins at the comedy stars, like, damn, these fools are talented. I want to take them out for a double scoop, eh? When I first heard Reagan and Watkins, I wanted to kill myself. So I guess it's just like any other day. Uh -huh. Dude, the first time I heard Reagan and Watkins, I was like, man, this some hot shit right here, man. Oh, man, what is this? It's some kind of comedy genius right here. Man, I miss love songs, Pat. Tell me about it. The way they used to write songs about women was so beautiful. I don't know if I could write a love song about women now. Like, what would a love song about the 21st century girl even sound like? She's got duck lips and cell phones for hands. She's a 21st century girl and I'm her man. Regan Watkins style? I don't know how to put it into words. But it makes me confused. But it makes me angry. It makes me question, who am I? Reagan and Watkins has a lot of things going for them stylistically. They talk about butts, which we like. They also talk about tits. They also talk about puss. They talk about girls squirting. And that's what we're really into. Mm-hmm. Reagan and Watkins give us hopes for all the inmates. When I first heard Reagan and Watkins, I was disgusted. It was like a couple of pigs with instruments just bleeding into the stereo system. Yuck! Hey, are you the guy? Yes, I'm the guy. Are you sure? Are you sure? You're the guy. You're the guy. Well, now you're making me wonder, but I'm pretty sure I'm the guy. I'm not a cop, why would you say that? Because I'm not a cop, yes, so why would you say that? Because this is illegal, hey man, could you be sorry with your voice? I'm sorry, I guess draw a lot of attention. If I were to compare Reagan Watkins to one band, it would be my favorite band, My Chemical Romance. The only other super duo that compares to Reagan Watkins are Donnie and Marie Osmond. Man in the studio with Reagan and Watkins, what I wouldn't give to be there watching them sing and play like two little cherubs. Yeah, man, I feel like it was tough because they seemed like tortured souls underneath all the funny, funny business. I didn't know saxophones belonged in country, but I'll be goddamn. Is it necessary to have a saxophone player in the band? Fuck yeah it is! Or maybe it isn't. How dirty is too dirty? One time this fool ate my panocha from the front to the back to the back to the front to the back to the front again and that still wasn't as dirty as the Reagan and Watkins album. Dirty can never be too dirty. And that's what I like about that Reagan and Watkins volume that they put into that album. It's like, it's dirty to a certain extent, it's dirty to a certain level, but it's like, you really don't hear that many curse words in it. So it's like, kind of like mentally capable of talk, you know what I'm saying? I'll tell you how dirty is too dirty. Reagan and Watkins is too dirty. Oh, let's talk about cum. Let's talk about nipples and buttholes and wieners and penises and vaginas. Oh, that'll be funny. That'll be the funniest thing I've ever heard. Yeah, right. It's degrading to women, and I don't appreciate it. Nothing is too dirty. Sex with your mom, your mom. All joking aside, your mom's loving is a bomb, the bomb. Christmas is gonna get real weird, cause I have two sons of my own. Meet Taylor and Billy, we like sports.
Yeah, man, I heard the fans be going crazy and stuff, dog. What are the fans gonna think? They better fucking like it, or they're gonna have to come see this bitch right here. I think Reagan and Watkins is the best thing to ever happen to music or comedy, and you can pretty much ask any one of my peers, and they'll tell you the same thing. Reagan and Watkins suck. Dick. Reagan and Watkins are not attractive. They look like young boys, and they're not smart or funny or musical. You get a guy like Reagan and Watkins stink that fucking bad. I don't know why they keep getting sets, but like, you know, I know I'm the older guy. I mean, maybe that's the new style of comedy, but like, if that's what comedy is, I'm gonna be out of business soon. When I first heard Reagan and Watkins, I actually thought there was something wrong with them. You know, like, you know, you know. For me, Reagan and Watkins embodies sexual healing, deep vaginal healing, deep down into my cervix. Are you talking about Reagan and Watkins again? In my fucking house? Sweetie, I was just excited. Don't ever bring them up again in my fucking house! That's not music, baby. It's like white walkers being stabbed by dragon glass. Fuck them! I'm oh, sorry. Oh sorry, God. guys. My God. My God. Was that even necessary? You know, when we first started dating, I would play Reagan and Watkins as ambient music behind our lovemaking, so I don't even know why... that's a bitch. Get the fuck out of my house. You know, the best part of Reagan and Watkins' show is when it's done, you know? Like, as soon as that light comes on and you're just like, wow! Reagan and Watkins? Ugh. Not my cup of tea, in my opinion. But, whatever. Teach his own. I actually think they're bad for comedy, you know? They're worse for comedy than the abolition of free speech. Honestly, if you had no music on, and the room you were in was just zero sound, that would be better music than what they're giving you. And that's not even music. Reagan and Watkins, the comedy musical duo, they're a real fucking stain on comedy. I mean, comedy music, thanks Steve Martin covered it already with the banjo. Suck a dick. There's no number to describe however bad or awful. On a zero to 10, they're fucking 10,000. That's how much they suck. Reagan and Watkins is like the Beach Boys. If uh, they were terrible, they never grew up, and nobody liked them. <laughs> I got my skateboard, got your lip gloss. You touched my shoulder, so awkward. I got you tickets. To the warm tour, you got me gauges from the hot topic store. This summer, I think I will fall in love. This summer, I think I will finally be hot. This summer, you cheat on me with my best friend. This summer, I hope that it never ends. This summer.